Hey, good morning, guys. It's Trey. Welcome back to the channel. It's about 4 a.m. here in Germany right now. We are actually flying out to Chicago today. So really excited. Haven't been back to the States in almost a year. But I decided to bring the Patagonia bags along with us. Right here, we've got the 70 liter, the 55 liter, and the 40 liter. Now, obviously, as you can tell by the title of the video, we are going to see if we can make it on an international flight with the 55 liter duffel bag. This is a very controversial bag. I've gotten a lot of comments from my other Patagonia video of people saying that they can never make it through with this bag. So we are gonna test that today. The 55 liter is a lot larger than the maximum legal carry on in the United States. I'm gonna be honest, I'm not too sure what the regulations are here in Europe, but it is obviously a lot smaller dimensions than it is in the United States. So. I have never personally taken this bag on any domestic European trip. Obviously, we live here in Germany. So, for example, when we've gone to Prague, when we've gone to Budapest, when we've gone to Malaga, Spain, when we go to Paris, this bag would never be able to make it on those short flights because it is just too big. So that is why I always use old trusty 40 liter here, which is great. They're all great. But obviously the 70 liter, you do have to check that bag. The 55 liter typically ends up having to be checked on domestic European flights and on most Asian airlines as well. US airlines are a lot more lenient and obviously the maximum legal carry on size is larger. And so this bag actually tends to pass in the United States. But like I said, we are gonna test the limits today. I do have a backup plan just in case I'm not able to take this bag. All of these bags are all packed out. So I am really interested to see what the airline has to say. We are flying on United, which is obviously an American based company, but we are here in Germany. And so we will see what happens. And I actually forgot to mention, but believe it or not, I've got about two weeks worth of clothes, jackets, diapers, baby clothes, pretty much everything under the sun. I have got it all in these bags right here. So the amount of storage and space that these bags have is just truly, truly incredible. And so with that being said, I will see you guys at the München Flughafen. All right guys, so we made it to the airport. Man, I, I don't know, looking at the bags now, for some reason the 55 looks almost identical to the 70 liter, it's crazy. The bags are a little bit heavy, so I think I'm gonna actually rent one of these carts. It's only a euro to rent, which is really awesome. So, all right, let's go ahead and head into the airport. So I think it's really important to mention the type of aircraft that we're flying on is a Boeing 787. Obviously the baggage compartments are gonna be a little bit larger. Now obviously the plane isn't as large as like a Boeing 747, but it's still a really large plane. It's got two separate aisles. And so, yeah, I thought that that would be something that's really important to mention. So it's not like this smaller regional plane over here. This plane is pretty large. Close it and check. Boom! Just like that. So don't let them tell you that the bag is too big. The bag fits perfectly. One more time for science. Boom! Okay, I'm probably gonna get kicked off the plane now. Fits, it fits, it fits. It does stick out a little bit and this thing is packed. Too. But the good thing about the black holes, you give it a little push and it still will go right up, no issues.
right we have made it to chicago it is freezing cold that's why there's so many people just standing around because nobody wants to be outside it's like negative 25 degrees outside fahrenheit uh, this is part one of the video see you guys on part two all right guys we are back at o'hare it's been a all right guys we are back at o'hare got the 70 got the 55 we bought a new monos bag as well i actually managed to stick the larger monos bag in the 70 liter bag so technically we bought two new monos bags but as you can see the 55 is packed out like crazy and i'm gonna see if they will allow me to check it so see you guys shortly all right guys i got the 55 in the container got our other bags right over here but for test purposes we're gonna see if this guy will close oh you guys should seriously have no issues bringing your 55 on any flight in the U.S. or headed to Europe. They fit perfectly fine. 